The bandage is fine. She needs to make sure you don't want that cut to open back up. We don't have time to waste on a flesh wound. He's all set, Detective. Thank you. Be sure to send the injury report to the PCPD. Will do. Thanks. Kevin, what happened? I've been looking for you everywhere. Eva, I'm... Uh... I, I'm so sorry I worried you. I, I couldn't call, and Detective Chase wanted to bring me directly here. What happened? Dr. Collins sustained an injury while he was at Ferncliff. He tried to stop Franco Baldwin before he escaped. Franco escaped? Did he do this to you? We'll find him. We've got an APB out, and he's injured. Dr. Collins managed to wound him before he escaped the institution. You mean you tried to stop him, and he did this? What were you thinking? I couldn't let him go. Kevin, he's already killed three people. You could have been the fourth. I, what would I do if something happened to you? I'm fine, Ava. I just wish I could have fought harder, prevented Franco from inflicting any further harm. Based on your description of the wound, it's likely he didn't get very far. I mean, he may even bleed out if he isn't found and treated. Excuse me. As I said earlier, I really didn't want to hurt Franco that, thank you, that badly. I just wanted to slow him down. You really haven't located him yet? No, oh, we're still working on it. But I wouldn't feel bad about doing what you had to do to stop Franco. If it means saving lives, I will nominate you for the Port Charles Pioneer Award myself. Could have been me. <laughs> Maybe the mayor will make the presentation herself, provided Laura decides to resurface. Uh, Laura's still out of touch? It's a bit unsettling, isn't it? The mayor is MIA, the police commissioner is fighting for her life. How is Jordan? I don't know. They won't tell me anything. Excuse me. Evacuate the surrounding houses and set up a perimeter. Nobody moves on the residence until I get there. I'm on my way. We have a location on Franco. Do you know his condition? No one's been inside the house yet, but I will update you as I know more. Chamberlain is dead. He's been dead for 20 years. Huh? Franco, come on, keep your eyes open. Franco, Franco! Is anyone else in the house? No, but he needs help. Wait. Wait. We're clear to send in paramedics. Oh, no, hurry, he's bleeding out. I'll meet you in the ER, okay? Okay, hang in there. I'll be right there. Wait, before I can let you go, I need to know exactly what happened. All I know is that my husband showed up on my doorstep bleeding profusely from what seems like a knife wound. I kept him alive and I called 911. Did he say anything? He said he lied. That he didn't kill those people. Ryan Chamberlain did. I know, he must have been delirious. Either that or a dead man did it. <laughs> 